So let's go over how a Google Docs collaboration assignment might work using my wife Violetti's fake enrollment in the course. In her shoes, I noticed that I got an email notification from my TA who started the collaboration. I can open that up and click on the icon to get started. Or I might happen to be on the course site where I can click on collaborations and see that I've been included in one. And if I click on it, I get sent to the very same place that I would get sent to from the email message. And it's a Google Docs file that I can edit. Now, because I need to be an active participant in order to get any points, and this assignment is in a score category worth 20% of the course grade, I should start out by adding something to the file to let the other participants know what I'm up to. I can put the cursor somewhere that makes sense and click on comments. And then I can click again on comment and say something useful that will be visible to the other participants. I can also click on notifications and choose the best setting. If I see that someone else is in the file at the same time, I can have a private chat with them. And of course, I can begin answering the questions. Although the chat session isn't recorded, the comments can always be seen by my TA who's grading the outcome, as can the revision history for the file. If it looks like nobody but me is going to participate, I can get a good score for almost whatever I do, even if all of the questions aren't answered. If I haven't heard from anyone else by Sunday night or so, I could also answer all of the questions myself and get a really good score. 